Let's take a moment now to kind of get still and, and we want to acknowledge that one presence that indwells us, that surrounds us, that enfolds us, in which we live and move and have our being, and yet which is so much a part of us that it is veritably a dimension of us. It is so important that we free ourselves from the intellectual concepts, techniques, definitions, even verbal treatments from time to time, and just acknowledge that our relationship to the infinite is not something that we can turn on or off, not something that we can create or even expand, but something which is. And that all of our efforts in prayer or meditation, in treatment, are basically intended to enable us to let go, to find our center within the allness of the infinite, and to let the healing flow do its perfect, normal, natural work. We suggest so often this beautiful concept expressed by the philosopher Plotinus in the early centuries after Jesus' time, when he talks about letting go of outside pressures, influences, and get the feeling that the whole universe is rushing, streaming, pouring into you from all sides while you sit quiet. So this day, in this consciousness of oneness in the infinite flow, may we feel free from prejudices, from preconceived notions. May we be open and receptive in mind and heart. May we feel a sense of objectivity as we consider that which is historical and even intellectual so that we can rightly and wisely gain a new sense of perspective of this that we call the new insight in truth. And above all, when may we go forth from here today with a greater sense of inner peace, greater confidence in the divine flow, greater sense of security and the radiance of love. We give thanks for this. Amen.